Greetings, Sky Cadets. Captain Lance Fantastic here, and before I head off on another top secret mission to defend our front lines for freedom, justice, and liberty for all, let me leave you with another episode of Diminutive Cinema. Yes, Diminutive Cinema, that collection of short films and movie serials of days long past, is back again, and this time we're bringing you the Fleischer Brothers' second episode in their classic Superman series. This time, episode two is Mechanical Monsters. Mechanical Monsters was released on November 28th, 1941 to the theaters, and this time we find the Man of Steel battling another diabolical evil scientist, who this time has an army of robots who are robbing and terrorizing the citizens of Metropolis. Did you know that DC Warner has identified the Fleischer Brothers classic Superman series as Earth F and was seen in the crossover series of the Arrowverse Crisis on Infinite Earths in 2019. Unfortunately, Earth F was destroyed by the anti monitor by a anti matter blast. And now it's time for me to get on with my mission and for Brooks to start the streaming service. Beginning movie playback, Captain Max. Fantastic. And here's wishing you clear skies, Sky Cadets. than a speeding bullet. More powerful than a locomotive. Able to leap tall buildings at a single bound. This amazing stranger from the planet Krypton, the man of steel, Superman. Empowered with X-ray vision, possessing remarkable physical strength, Superman fights a never-ending battle for truth and justice, disguised as a mild-mannered newspaper reporter, Clark Kent. doing here? Oh, just getting the woman's angle on this story. The mechanical monster! Look out! Thank <laughs> you. 
Come on, you fool. You want to get trampled? <laughs> You wait here. I'll phone this in. Yes, I'll give you the details later, Chief. All right, Lois. Let... Lois! Superman. This is going to make. The jewels. What have you done with the jewels? You'll read about it in tomorrow's paper. Are you going to tell me what happened to those jewels? <laughs> Thank you. 
That's a wonderful story, Lois. Thanks, Clark. But I owe it all to Superman. Superman. 